Vlastimil Gulat lost his voice after undergoing surgery for throat cancer a year ago. But thanks to a high-tech app spearheaded by two Czech universities, he's still able to use it. Our project is unique in that we are trying to create a tailor-made synthetic voice for each user. The app was developed for people who are set to lose their voice due to a laryngectomy or removal of the larynx, a typical procedure for throat cancer. <laughs> Ahead of surgery, scientists first record the patient reading as many sentences as possible. Then they use statistical models to create synthetic speech that can be played on the patient's mobile phones or tablets via the app. Jana is in the process of recording her voice ahead of a minor operation on her throat. If I have a problem and can't speak with my own voice, I would like my small children to still hear my voice, not a robotic one. Ideally, patients need to record more than 10,000 sentences to provide scientists with enough material to produce their synthetic voice. But cancer often demands swift treatment, which can limit a patient's time to do recordings. It's often a matter of weeks, three at the most, during which you can record the voice. Vlastimil managed to record only 477 sentences before having his larynx removed. I underwent total laryngectomy within 23 days of diagnosis. But even this paltry input provided enough information to produce a voice that he can call his own.